over here from time to time. He starts sneaking into the house and he's going to grab my head. It's a weird thing about human nature. If I grab his head, he wants to grab mine. Any of you guys watch MMA? Watch. The guy hit him with a leg kick. Boom. No joke. Ten seconds later, he's going to come back with a leg kick. It's weird. It's just the way the human nature works. So he wants to get in on that collar ties. I'm fully and here it comes. I do not let him stay here for no, no, no bit of time. No, no. He grabs my head. I get him off. Immediately. Now, my collar clear is a little different. And uh, I got it from Penn State, guys. None of this stuff comes from me, guys. It's from Gable and Brands. All the best coaches I've ever. Zelly, all the guys that I've learned from. None of it's from me. I want to use my collar tie to push. And I'm going to roll my head underneath his collar tie. Did I move his arm at all? I promise you, you're going to go out and do this. Or this. I don't move his arm. I move my head. So exaggerate. Ah, big roll. Big roll. Now where's his arm? The other side of my body. This is not a good place for it, right? Run a little short on time, so I'm going to go right into our elbow clear. Elbow pass. I'm going to push his elbow across, release my collar tie, and circle all the way hip to hip. Exaggerate it. This is where I'm trying to get. What's he going to do? Circle, square up with me. I'm going to wake him up. Jab, snap. Get him down to the mat. Jab with my forearm, snap him back down. Boom. Attack or attack. Contact close.